G'day viewers, there's been a bit of talk recently that we're going to have a mini ice age sometime in the next 15 to 30 years. It's going to be so cold! Could this be true when we've all been worried about warming temperatures caused by climate change? Could it be the opposite is going to happen? Of course that's not fucking true! It's so fucking obvious! As soon as I saw these headlines, are we having a mini ice age? Fuck off! No we're not! For, it's just like, oh wow, that's just such a great coincidence that as the fucking climate change deniers are losing every other battle, someone plucks out of a hat, there's gonna be a mini ice age. Look, the science is down here that explains in some detail why this isn't true. The short version. What happened? The National Astronomy Meeting in Wales had a presentation from someone who sounds a bit like a Bond villain. Valentina Zakova and her team's presentation talked about a reduction in sunspot activity that they were saying, coincidentally or not, uh, matches what they think was the level of sunspot arc activity in a previous cool period known as the Maunder Minimum, which some people called a mini ice age, although the cold temperatures really only affected Europe, it wasn't a global thing. So, some news outlets took this and ran with it and went, MINI ICE AGE! So, a few pertinent points. And I really think the biggest one is the people who did the paper themselves NEVER FUCKING SAID MINI ICE AGE. They raised that this could affect Earth's climate. The actual modelling shows that this level of sunspot activity would be lucky to have a 0.1% difference in the sun's output to Earth, which is going to be dwarfed by all the stuff that has been accurately, most definitely measured that's causing temperatures to rise. It's as simple as that. So it's like one non-peer-reviewed study based on somewhere in the region of 30 years worth of statistics does not trump all the peer-reviewed scientists that 97% of climate scientists agree with that humans are causing massive climate change on Earth and any minor difference in solar output isn't going to affect that! Not going to save us, okay? And possibly the most ridiculous part of the whole thing is the fucking global warming deniers going, Oh! See, look, I've got some science that says it's gonna be cold! What? So you pricks! can ignore just rafts of peer-reviewed studies. Just study after study after study that confirms that climate change is real and serious and now you're getting all the creepy scary stuff saying probably irreversible. That's depressing. But one thing that says, ah, maybe something completely implausible is going to happen and you go, science, I hold it up. This is the mentality of someone who has a doctor who tells them they have cancer. So they go to specialists and nine oncologists in a row tell them, yeah, you have cancer. But then a dentist tells them, no, you don't. And they go, the dentist has medical training. They know what they're talking about. I'll listen to them. So no, we're not going to have a mini ice age. It should have been obvious straight up that this was complete bullshit. But yeah, if you want to read more, read below. But in short, when someone comes up with something out of the blue that seems too good to be true, I personally would love it if we were going to get cold temperatures that counteracted the probable catastrophic impact of climate change. But this isn't it. It's not fucking happening. Wake the fuck up.